Today's state is Iowa. Hi, I'm John. And I'm Nancy. And, and we, we are JNN, JNN Travels. Travels. Number one, the Bridges of Madison County. This is a large group of covered bridges made famous by the best-selling 1992 novel by Robert Waller and the follow-up film starring Clint Eastwood and Meryl Streep. The covered bridges provide a beautiful route for our afternoon drive and are a unique part of the area's identity. Mark your calendar for Winter Set, Iowa's annual covered bridge festival held each October with a parade, vintage cars, kids' activity, films, and much more. Number two, Grotto of the Redemption. In West Bend, the stunning Grotto of the Redemption is the world's largest man-made grotto. The site includes nine separate grottos and took more than 40 years to complete. It contains the world's largest collection of precious stones and gems. Regardless of your religious beliefs, the Grotto of the Redemption is a man-made one that few would expect to find in rural Iowa. Find out why some people call it the eighth wonder of the world. Number three, Field of Dreams. Decades after the release of the 1989 cult classic, fans still flock to the Field of Dreams movie site in Diversville, Iowa. There are a few scenes more iconic than shoeless Joe Jackson and the other ghostly baseball players emerging from the towering stalks of corn. Experience the magic yourself by taking in a Ghost Sunday pickup game or spending the night in the field's historic farmhouse. Number four, the Iowa State Fair. Each year, the 11-day Iowa State Fair attracts everyone from people watches to prospective politicians. From deep-fried foods and competitions to live music on the grandstand, there's something for everyone at the fair. They say nothing compares to the Iowa State Fair, and there's nothing more Iowan than enjoying food on the stick, waving hello to the butter cow, and taking in the sights along the midway. Number five, Blue Bunny Ice Cream. Life is sweet in Lamar's. This small northwest Iowa city is the home of Blue Bunny Ice Cream and has been affectionately known as the ice cream capital of the world since 1994. Indulge your sweet tooth with a visit to the Blue Bunny Ice Cream Parlor. Then learn about this sweet piece of the city's history at the adjacent museum. After that, count the more than 50 ice cream sculptures across the city. Number six, the Villisca Axe Murder House. In June of 1912, eight people were brutally murdered in their beds in southwestern Iowa town of Villisca. The killer was never caught, and today the Villisca Axe Murder House draws true crime aficionados from all over the world. If you're into the occult, this notorious haunted house is not to be missed. The price of admission gets you into the house, and if you're extra brave, you can opt to spend the night there for a higher rate. Number seven, Toppling Goliath Brewery. Founded in 2009, Decorah... Toppling Goliath Brewery has quickly become one of the state's most well-known craft breweries. This brewery has a beautiful tap room in the rolling hills of northeast Iowa and serves a variety of popular craft brews, including a pale ale called Pseudo Sioux, created in conjunction with Chicago's Field Museum. Number eight, Snake Alley. Once known as the crookedest street in the world by Ripley's Believe It or Not, Snake Alley is Burlington's curvy claim to fame. It even shows up as a squiggle on Google Maps. Built in 1894, Snake Alley is as much an offbeat attraction as it is part of this Mississippi River town's history. The street was used to test the ability of carriage pulling fire department horses. Much like San Francisco's Lombard Street, making the descent on this crooked street is a feat for the braver drivers. Number nine, future birthplace of James T. Kirk. On March 22nd, 2228, in a small southeast Iowa town, a starship captain will be born. Head to Riverside to visit the future birthplace of Star Trek Captain James T. Kirk. Even if you aren't a sci-fi fan, Riverside's excitement about Captain Kirk is contagious. Visit his future birthplace, pop into the Voyage Home Museum to see Star Trek memorabilia, and sneak into the back room of Murphy's Bar and Grill to see the plaque marking the point where Kirk will be conceived. Number 10, tour Johnny Carson's birthplace. Pop culture buffs can rejoice in Corning, Iowa. Visit Johnny Carson's birthplace and pay homage to the legendary Tonight Show host. The home still stands in all of its glory, given the great insight into the humble life of Carson. Please subscribe by hitting the subscribe button or click on the frog icon on the video. Don't forget to click the bell to get notified of our future videos. And of course, please click on the thumbs up. And remember, stay young and have fun.